Hello children, how are you all? Welcome to Smiley's channel. Today we are going to discuss about short form in math. Children, I will explain what is short form with examples when we are discussing the examples that time because it will be easy for you to understand. So before that there are few points which you need to remember while writing the short form. So look at the first point. Write the leftmost initial digit of a number. So when you need to write a short form, so always choose the leftmost initial digit. So that is the first point. The second point if you observe, if any place value is missing in the expanded form of a number with 0, in that place you need to write 0. So we will just see the same points with examples now. As I said, I'll explain what is short form. So when we are talking about the example, so look here, what is short form means the sum of the expanded form number. So writing the sum of the expanded form numbers according to its place value is called short form. Sum is nothing but adding and writing the answer according to the place value of the digits is called short form. So look here, 50 plus 2. So look at the first point did you remember? So what is the first point? So you when you are writing a short form you need to choose the leftmost digit initial digit uh, you need to choose and write. So that is the first point as we discuss. So in 50 what is the left leftmost initial digit? Here it is 5. So we are writing 5 in 2. So we have only a single digit. So we are directly writing 2. If you have 60 and 2, 6, 2. If you have 70 plus 4, 7 plus 4. So next we are discussing with 3 digit number that is 200 plus 30 plus 9. So the leftmost initial digit 2, 3, 9. So 539 if you have 5, 3, 9. 642, 600 again 4 is the leftmost initial digit and 9. So that is how in 3 digit numbers. So this is the 4 digit number here. So the same thing we are following the leftmost initial digit. So that is in 4000 it is 4, 600 it is 6, 50 it is 5 and 2 we have a single digit directly we are writing. So this is one way. So even if you have a very big number also it is fine children. So you can follow the same method. So that makes easier for you to write. So the leftmost initial digit in 20,000 it is 2 and in 6,000 what is the leftmost initial digit can you tell me? Yes it is 6. Next in 200 it is 2. In 40 it is 4. So again 2 is a single digit number directly it comes. So that is one way of writing short form. Now we are discussing the second point children. So did you remember what is that? If any place value is missing in expanded form how to write the short form of that particular number. So here you just see. 200 plus 0 plus 2. So he, this is 1's place and this is 10's place and this is 100's place. See 3 digits we have so 1's 10's 100. So if you get in this way you can follow the first method only leftmost initial digit 2 0 2. So 2 0 2 200 2. So for example there are some cases so this 0 will be missing. So in the exam, so that is one another pattern to ask the question of expanded form. So that is here 200 plus 2. Here you will come to know it is a single digit number and this is a hundreds place, ones, tens and hundreds place. So you must think and you have to notice the tens place value is missing. So then what to do in that time you have to think and write 
0 so that is the second point if any place value is missing either it is hundreds place or tens place or ones place so you need to write 0 in that particular place value so if you have 400 plus 2 the same thing 4 0 2 500 plus 4 500 in 500 leftmost initial digit 5 0 4 so that is how you need to write children so if we'll, we are discussing with here with 4 digit number see in 8000 what is the leftmost initial digit 8 here we have 0 0 in 10 1 is the leftmost initial 1 and 9 so if they ask you in this format it is absolutely fine in case there is a chance to get a question in another format that is they will not include 0 so that time you need to think so once this is tens and here we have thousand see ones tens hundreds and thousand hundreds place is missing so that time you should notice that you have to see the place values of the numbers and you have to write so 8 again hundreds place value is missing so you need to write 0 and 1 and 9 so I hope you understood the concept children for better understanding watch the video again and again if you like the video please like share and subscribe to my channel and click on bell icon for my new video notifications thank you so much for watching